The Travado 59G floor plan includes one of the most amazing bathrooms in a Class B RV van. Today, I show you how to clean the secondary filter from the shower drain pump, how fast it is to clean, and strangely, Winnebago solved this problem by replacing the whole system with a taller floor and a gravity drain. So if you have a Travado G prior to 2022 and don't know how to clean your shower filter and you want to learn how to do that, watch this video. All right, first step is to empty your galley cabinet under the sink. So let's do that first. Okay, with the galley empty, what I'm going to do is remove this pan right here, the, um, the, the cabinet floor, and I'm going to be very careful with my soft soap. I'm going to raise the bottle, and which is Velcroed, just slightly, and then remove this and let this kind of hang so that it doesn't pull out of the soap dispenser. Okay, let me show you the, the um, exact um, situation right here. So this is the, the pump in question right here. This is the shower pump right here. And this is the filter that needs to be cleaned right here. Now this is upside down as compared to the, um, to the manual. And I'll show you how to do that real quick here in just a second. So what you're seeing here is the, the soap bottle that has the tube that goes up and around. You can see that to the soap dispenser that's um, on the uh, bathroom sink. So that's what that looks like. Uh, let me get some towels and we will um, turn this real quick to clean the filter. So there is going to be a little bit of water in the system here because I did shower this morning. Um, but this just tucks in like that. And then you thumb screw um, this cap off. Now, ironically, in the Winnebago manual, this is totally reversed. So this is actually showing up. And you do it like this. But in mine, it's actually upside down. But that's okay. Uh, same thing happens. So we just twist it off very easily like that. And this is the little doodad right here. So you can see that screen in there. And uh, that's what we want to clean out. Uh, so again, really, really simple. I'm doing this about every probably 10th shower. And that seemed to be working pretty good. Um, 10 showers is about um, maybe three weeks uh, of showering for me. So let's uh, clean this bad boy and just rinse it in the sink with this silver mesh. That just pops out like this. Like that, right? Okay, it's good to clean. Hey, if we're meeting for the first time, hello. My name is Scott. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Go Small, Live Large. Channel all about the Class B camper van RV lifestyle. Here, we give you van tours. We give you places to take your van. And we give you van RV tips to be a better RVer. Please subscribe to the channel. If that kind of content is of interest to you, comment below and give it a thumb up if you learn anything from this video. Thank you. Okay, we're just going to take this out like this, and you can see that it's fairly dirty. It's kind of hard to see, uh, but not too bad. So let's just get a little water going here. You can hear the shower pump, and it's just lint and really fine stuff. Um, it cleans out really easily. You can hear the shower pump working. The shower pump's just underneath the cabinet drawers. Okay, that looks much better, right? Give this guy a little swish out. Okay. Let that strain through the strainer. This just pops back in like that. Just like that. And this goes back on, let's put it under, underneath the sink. So here we just reverse the process. So it goes inside the, uh, the cabinet and let it grab the screw points. A firm tightening, but not too tight. Now what I might want to do is just test that real quick to make sure that it is actually not going to leak and make sure it's not. So we can see if it leaks. Okay, so I'm going to just put a little shower water in and let's do that quick and then turn on the pump. Let's put this right here. Now we're going to adjust the diverter, turn the water on. Water coming out, 
let that fill for a second. That's probably enough. And then we'll turn the charger pump on. That. Ends nice and dry. Perfect. Shower pump off. And what we've done is, again, clean this uh, filter. So this is a secondary filter. The primary filter is on, under the, the pan, as we know. So just for your information. So again, this is the shower pump. Right here is the water pump. Hard to see from this angle. I apologize. Um, but you can see that it has the same kind of a little thing right here, right? Uh, it's really hard to see, sorry. Um, and I've had this actually come loose. So I'm just tightening it right here since I have everything open to make sure that it uh, doesn't jostle loose with vibration and doesn't leak. So with that, I am satisfied and we're gonna put the floorboard back in and then fill the cabinet back up. And that would be how you clean the shower filter. So hey, if you got anything out of this, again, thumb up, appreciate that. Comment below, was this difficult? Does this scare you? Is this a problem for you at all? Is this something you can tackle? I know you can. Hey, until we see you soon, wish you to journey on.